Many people don't realise, but as our dogs get older, their diets need to change to ensure they're getting the right amount of nutrients and support for their ageing muscles and bones. Nick, at what age should we start to consider doing this for our dogs? It's bad news, mate. As you get older, you need to start thinking about health concerns. So your joints, your muscle, your tissue, your brain, and especially your weight health as well. So dogs are considered mature adults, primarily at the age of seven. Now that's if they spend the bulk of their adult life under 25 kilos. But dogs that actually are over 25 kilos become mature adults at the age of five. Wow, that's young. It is young. Most dogs will spend the bulk of their lifetime in their mature adult years. Right. Well, one of the glow food range is mature chicken. So what are some of the key ingredients in that? So one of the key differences in the mature adult diet is that it's got a bigger kibble. And that's really important, so we make sure we look after the dog's teeth as they get into their later years. And then we really want to make sure we look after their joints and their muscles and their bones. So Glow's mature adult is enriched in glucosamine and chondroitin sulfate, which is really, really important. And then we've got beet pulp and chicory as well, which actually helps the dog stay fuller for longer. Because mm -hmm. with an older dog, you really want to make sure there's not a lot of pressure on the kidneys. So low in salt and make sure that it's really calorie controlled so you don't end up with any weight problems down the track. Right. So that so many owners don't realise that their dogs are overweight. Now, how much of an impact has that on their lives? It has a huge impact. I mean, we generally see most dogs start to have their issues around the age of six and seven plus, and that's generally attributed because maybe the diet they've been on for their adult years has not been the best. Mm. We definitely know there's a lot of problems around weight. Almost half the dog population in Australia is now considered to be overweight or obese. So really making sure that the diet is lower in protein and lower in fat so you don't have those weight challenges moving on into its later life stage. And in particular, really low in salt so that you don't have a lot of kidney problems moving on. Much like ourselves. Absolutely. Any other tips for owners of mature dogs? So it's really important that people are comfortable with the fact that their dogs are gonna start becoming mature adults at the age of five or seven. So making sure they keep them fit and active and feed them a really good quality diet is really important. But with any diet transition, when you're moving from adult into mature adult, make sure you do it gradually again. Give yourself a couple of weeks to get the dog used to the fact that there's been a change in its diet. Fantastic. Well, speaking about keeping up an active lifestyle, if you'd like to learn more about the Glow Food Range, take your pet for a walk down to your local pet stock and ask one of their friendly staff members to give you some advice on caring for a mature dog.